Are you starstruck? It's Miguelito and Party. Yeah. In the bar. A living legend. Say hi. <laughs> Gracias. <laughs> a living legend, but apparently also a normal guy. I'm a legend also in Mexico. Are you a legend in Mexico? Yeah. Why, are, why can't I hear any like chants about you in Mexico? Junk. You're young. People don't know you yet. Hola, buenas. <laughs> See? I feel like here, sitting here. Yeah, right now. Now I'm watch Lamperti and John Sands. There. The right here. The perfect table for Pista Central. Yeah. Can it get any better for lunch entertainment? No. No. You were talking about this guy down here being a li living legend as well. Yeah, Sebastian Nerone. Sebastian Nerone. A lot of players in the club today, eh? In including, including, including us, yeah. obviously. From. This court is perfect for you. You can smash everything, everything. Contodísimo, eh? I can I can say this because I have the fucking shittiest smash as well. I have the shittiest smashes. <laughs> How is Platonic treating you? Sometimes Platonic is good. Yeah. When you have a, a guy in the other side that is more or less 50 years old, he's yes. like, only drop shots. Yeah. And just want to win the match. Yes. Sure, sure. Yes. 6 2, 6 1, 6 2, 6 1 for me. For the champion of Platonic. Only Platonic. Yes. <laughs> the, be the best jugador in Platonic. We just finished watching the matches of Gravilial, Semler versus Lamperti. It was a nice match. I'll show you some of the highlights, obviously. But right now I'm waiting to go into train. The last training of the week. Weather right now, 
isn't really helping the energy to get up. As you can see, it's pretty cloudy, pretty bad, pretty rainy. It's not usual for Madrid, but they need to go in and warm up a little now to get hyped up. And hopefully we can like get some momentum going, get some energy going with, with a good partner and play some good matches. I'm standing out here in the like uh, outdoor, like the terras of M3. It's not a lot of people right here when it's raining, believe it or not, but people don't like to sit in the rain. Wow, how smart you are, Pontus, for giving us that conclusion. I know, thank you. No, you're welcome, I mean, it doesn't matter, whatever. What a retard. Okay. Oh, on my way home from the training, my mind is broken, my body is broken. Well, I don't know if you can see it, but my headset is broken. Everything is broken. Uh, but anyways, I might play a nightly tournament tomorrow. It depends on if we can get a slot. A guy from the club asked me to join him for, for a nightly tournament, so I might do that. If I can play that tournament tomorrow, I'll bring the camera, film a little from that. I'm just gonna die in the metro now for a little while and go home, get something to eat, take a shower and crash in bed, hopefully, and not wake up too early tomorrow that's the that's the goal of this night so thank you for watching so far if you're still with me with this low energy hopefully i can have a little more energy tomorrow oh and yeah if you're wondering the weather is still fucking shit look at this piece of shit weather i left sweden to leave this no it's here joder tío the next day. We are on our way to the metro station. We're gonna take the train to Getafe. The nightly tournament is gonna happen. It's gonna start in about two hours. So at uh, half past nine, we're gonna get going. I'm meeting up a friend at Getafe Central who I'm gonna play with, and then he's gonna drive me there. So yeah, it's gonna be nice. I'm hoping that I can stay awake for the while being, because it's gonna get pretty late and I'm not used to that, but we'll do our best, eh? So I'll see you there. A few minutes later. Okay, parking. What a parking. Now we just have to go and take out some money, eh? <laughs> We're following. Where's the bank? There. No, not Santander anymore. No. <laughs> had to take another bank. <laughs> parking out. It's not, not, oh, it's, yeah, I think that's one of the free ones for me. For yeah, I think so. <laughs> I think so. We are ready. Is this your, is your first tournament? My, no, not, not my first uh, time to paddle. I played time to paddle before as well. But not at night, though. <laughs> this is late. It's, what is it now? It's Nine? Cool at night, right? Yeah, it's pretty cool. I guess there's not a lot of, like, children in the, at the same, oh, we got a soda. No, but I mean. We have, we have, they give us a perrito. Perrito? What is that? Uh, a snack? No. A sandwich? No. Hot dog. Hot dog? <laughs> wow. How luxurious. A hot dog. <laughs> nice. <laughs> God dang hot dog. In the middle of the road. Go, 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 go. Alejandro y Pontus. Estamos
match to success. Uh, we have played two matches now. And how do you think it went? Kumpa. Uh, we played very, very well. Yeah. 6-1, yeah. 6-1. Now we're waiting for one or two matches to play our last uh, game in the, in the group place. And then hopefully we can keep on winning. Now this guy was interested in what's going on here. Let's film him a little. Put some pressure on. <laughs> there we go. Well, all fun and games at least. These night tournaments seem to be a little fun and games. No, <laughs> <laughs> Oh, we gotta take the hot dog later. We get a free hot dog for entering the tournament. One bottle of water, free hot dog, and a banana. I mean, and a big banana. And a big banana. It's free good. Banana. Free bananas, not just, just one. You can take, you can take as many as one. Yeah. Oh, that we can we can earn money here. It's tw 22 euros and all the banana you can eat. I mean, it's perfecto. Mucho. So we won our, uh, our third game as well. We were slacking a little. It was uh, a little too easy, all our games. So we were like chilling a little. And we gave away, we were down 3-2, three, 3-1. Three, like the format is uh, one set matches. If it goes to 5-5, five, five, there is a tie break that will settle it. And we were down 3-1, so we won the first two matches, 6-1 and 6-1. And then we were down 3-1 and we were like, okay, maybe we need to step up a little. But eventually we turned it around and won 6-3, so that was good. Uh, that we could change the rhythm and actually get a little hyped. Uh, now we're waiting for the, for the last matches of the other groups to finish. And we're going to play, uh, uh, play some playoffs. So probably quarterfinals into semifinals into hopefully final and hopefully I win and it's really late now the clock is uh, it's midnight right now and hopefully hopefully the, the, the last group stages doesn't take too long because it's gonna be a long ass night here in Getafe but it's pretty fun it's pretty fun we got our free hot dog before it was disgusting but it was some energy at least if we win there is like one Adidas racket up for grabs each, I think. I think we get a Adidas racket each for the win. And it was 20, 22 euros to enter. So it's not that bad. Uh, it's more, more to just get matches going. And uh, we both kind of agreed on that we probably could have entered the A category instead of the B. But since we didn't know the level, we were like, uh, I'd, rather, I'd rather win easy than lose hard uh, in the beginning. But now we know that we could have entered a higher category and in order to get a little more hyped as well like we haven't played our best paddle either one of us yet we've just like put the ball in metella metella and because that's a uh, that has been enough we we haven't had to do anything else so let's go for the finals let's go playoffs let's win a fucking paddle racket man let's win a fucking paddle racket
Eventually, what happened? We lost in the semis. We lost in the semifinals, and uh, we, we couldn't do anything. It was like it was unlucky. Right? <laughs> it's yeah. always it's always bad luck. Yeah, <laughs> there was <laughs> no. We could have we could have played better, but they had some luck and some important points. One of the points we talked about before that was they got a break from a really lucky side glass boost in early stages, and we kind of lost a little momentum, but. In the end, we could have played way better. We could have played, especially me, I could have played way more aggressive. Oh, me too. And that's what happens. We lost 6-4, and they're probably going to win the final pretty easy, the guys we played yeah. against, I think. It, it was uh, the, the semi-final was the final. Yeah, our semi was the real final. But uh, paddle is like this. Paddle is like this, and that's what fucking sucks, dude. And if we look a little closer to what the time is right here <laughs> as well. Yeah. Getting home now with just coming back in the home <laughs> at two thirty four. Two thirty four before without, losing the semi final. Without after losing without the a paddle racket. Without <laughs> a paddle <laughs> racket. <laughs> but we had funny. Eh? We had funny. Eh? And I got a really nice ride home, which I appreciate. Of course. So that's um, well that was yeah, it. Yeah, we had a good time really. We had a good time. We got a hot dog as well. Next time we we, we promise that Next time we're gonna bring a fucking paddle racket home. <laughs> 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 <laughs>